In the previous lecture, we uh, created these different maps from the base map, right? You can see the base map, this one, and we created these. Now, let's say if you know find the areas of these region, how we would you do that? So, in order to find the areas, what you can do is you can go to these, go to the open attribute table, and here you can add a new field, add field, and you can name it area, let's say. And here you can select that, let's say double, and then OK. And now you can go click on right click here on the area and select calculate geometry. And here you can select area square meters, OK. And you can see the areas are now there. Let's change the unit from square meters to something else. So properties, no, not properties. We can go to, okay, let's go to calculate geometry again. And I'll change that to maybe square kilometers. So let's do that. And here we go. So it have calculated the areas of these regions for our self. You can change that and maybe select a proper unit that you want to. So, okay, what happened here? I think it has, okay. Now, also, okay. So these are the areas, right? Now for the road, you can go to open attribute table. And let's say if you add a new field here, right? And you say length, right? And here that's done. Now go to the calculate geometry and you can see property length and then meters and then okay. Yes, and you can see it's this much meter. Let's change it to kilometers or miles, let's say. So, okay, sorry. Calculate geometry. And let's say I'll change it to miles and length and okay. So it is 718 miles from Sarnia to mentor. Let's verify this if it's true. Or can open Google Earth Pro and use that to do this. Now let me show you how. Now here I'll give Sarnia. Let's see if it takes us to Canada. Yeah, I think it is the these these are the three legs, right? Now let's go like this and like this, right? So let me just go and select the line here, and you can see measurements and miles. Miles will be shown here. So I'm just roughly starting from here because you can see in our arches we started a little bit from the back. So let's say we go like this, and then we keep on going like this. Loveland. So it is, um, and then we went some like this. Let's see. Yeah, Mentor and Sarnia. Yeah. So, and I think we also had some of the, we can increase this a little bit. And anything else to be, you get this much. Yeah, that's fine. So you can see it's almost that much it's it is 653 so near to uh the calc is 653 miles this distance right you can see this distance almost the distance that we calculated here so it means that's that makes sense right so this it this is actually uh the correct length so this is how you can calculate the length and the area using your arcgis data so i hope you understood that in the next lecture we'll continue and discuss further thank you